way we make books. You cannot do that digital. As long as people can write and uh, print things and have books, this business will always stay. Um, can you maybe help us? I will, yes. I will, of course, down. but I... Uh, okay, can so you first we're clip gonna... these here? If it's not too difficult. Could you could you say something? Hello. Yeah, it's perfect. Okay. Okay, so the sound is there. I'm Arnold. I'm uh, 51, and uh, I live upstairs here. Could you share the origin of the bookbinder shop and how the whole family tradition of bookbinding started? We started in the Regeli Breestraat, that's uh, near Tosinski, in the back of a jewelry. Then in 1953 to Gerard Douwstraat and in the 70s we moved here. My step-grandfather, he started it with doing some books and that became more and more. Right now it's only family, uh, so my sister, me and her uh, partner and my parents, if they are here, then they uh, are working also uh, a few days a week. Some daily challenges that I find in this business are it's all different, so we don't have a lot of the same work. Everyone nowadays comes with different books and different materials. And we used to do a lot of books for libraries and that was all the same. We used to work here with a few people and only go to libraries and other lawyers. Nowadays that's more or less and now people are coming here with their own books. That was very difficult in the beginning because we had our work always and then that disappeared mm -hmm. and then a friend of mine uh, did get a baby and he wanted a baby book so I said, uh, I will make a baby book if you make a website for me. <laughs> and then I started learning about the website. And so we get more customers through internet and uh, that helped a lot. Digitalization. Uh, worked for me also because we did get an internet website and get more customers uh, to here and uh, then it, it first it was a normal website then it became a web shop so we sell also online first blank books now we sell uh, materials we have online but uh, we get more people also that coming here to buy the materials and blank books and that's becoming more and more so that will uh, 
keep us up for the next few years, I think. Uh, the way we make books, you cannot do that digital. Uh, you cannot make leather books digital. Uh, you cannot make uh, linen books uh, digital. There are machines that can make uh, in a fabric a lot of books at the same time, but uh, we make customized books uh, and each one is different, so that is not possible for uh, machines. They say for years books will go away, but that didn't happen and people are still reading more and more books. As long as people can write and uh, print things and have books, this business will always stay. Hi. Hi. <laughs> okay, this is good. Yes? Okay. Oh, how can I take an actual picture? Huh? How can I take an actual picture?